And Raleigh Durham International Airport is expecting a high number of travelers this weekend, and Elon students are among the many heading home for the Thanksgiving holiday. With airlines short staffed and bookings above pre pandemic levels, travelers may be met with turbulence before they board. Director of Media Relations at RDU, Stephanie Hawko, says the airport is working to make travel as smooth as possible. We know that we need to staff up for the holidays and we do that on a regular basis. The labor challenge has been a shortage. As you mentioned, it's hitting the airlines, it's hitting concessionaires in terms of restaurants and stores. So that is something that I think we're dealing with as an airport, just like the country is dealing with as a whole. This after a water leak damaged an electrical distribution center at RDU, causing a near six hour power outage in Terminal 2 Friday. Hawko says she doesn't anticipate having any difficulties related to the leak in the days ahead. It was a difficult day. We want to apologize to everybody who has suffered an inconvenience and a disruption in their flight schedules. We know that was a really tough day, but we don't anticipate that happening again next week. Hawko advises travelers to book parking in advance and arrive at least two hours early before their flight. To check your flight status, see at RDU Airport on Twitter. And if you're flying out of Greensboro, see their website, flyfrompto.com. Many of us are traveling home for Thanksgiving, but some Elon